So now that we are headed into the second half of 2021, I think it's safe to say that this year has been absolutely insane for real estate. It definitely has been a seller's market. But in this video, we're going to talk about the four things that have contributed to the current real estate market as it is. Hey everyone, it's Blaine Cruz, real estate expert advisor. Welcome back to the channel. Thank you to everyone who has subscribed so far. We're slowly headed towards our next major milestone in subscribers, and I certainly appreciate each and every one of you being a part of it. If you're new here and haven't subscribed yet, it would be awesome if you would. I certainly would be grateful, and if you like this content today, don't forget to hit that like button and share it with someone you think uh, might wanna see this information and find it useful. With that said, uh, let's go ahead and get this party started. So what are those four components that has created this unprecedented market we're in? One is the low inventory. Uh, the number of homes available to buy has been at record lows. Nationally right now, it is about two and a half months worth of inventory with the lowest it's been was around two months uh, earlier this year. In my market, the greater Houston area, it has spent most of this year at 1.4 months of inventory and the last reported numbers had it at one and a half uh, months. Uh, we have seen a very slight gain in the number of homes available lately, which is great news, although it isn't significant and it is still a strong seller's market. This has created a huge opportunity for these homeowners looking to make a move. Number two is the increased buyer competition. Interest rates continue to be historically low and it has a lot of people wanting to take advantage of that situation, causing increased buyer demand. This increased buyer demand and low inventory increases competition for buyers and puts many into bidding wars. Homes for sale have been getting on average about five offers to choose from. In order to win the home, buyers are getting very aggressive with their offers. They are doing things such as offering above asking price, uh, paying cash, waiving contingencies such as the option period. In some states, they call it the due diligence period, I think. Uh, and they're waiving the appraisal. This is all great for the sellers. Number three is the rising home prices. All this competition and the bidding wars are forcing home prices up. Nationally, as of May, home prices were up over 15% from May in 2020. Here in the greater Houston area, that number is closer to 24% for single family homes. Number four is the rise in home values and home equity. When the home prices in an area increase, this increase, uh, it increases the value of homes in that area. You combine that with homeowners who have continued to pay their mortgages, it has helped increase their equity tremendously. Homeowners are taking advantage of this home equity to upgrade their, to their dream home or to help them accomplish some other major goal they have in their life. It is definitely a great time to sell right now, but uh, if you're in the greater Houston area, I can definitely help you think through all the scenarios of buying your first house or selling your current house, which may or may not include buying it, your next house. Get in touch with me by going to my digital business card at www.blaincruise.pro and find the way to reach out to me that works best for you and just connect with me. If you are outside of my market, you can still reach out. I have a huge network of agents that I can definitely put you in contact with that covers your area. Well, thanks for watching and remember with Blaine Cruz, extraordinary comes standard.